What's up guys, it's Brandon Jay. Welcome to the most beautiful spring in the world. Woohoo! I you... love this place. This is my new paradise, baby. Oh baby, we are back. Look at this place. Oh my gosh, I missed it so much. What is going on guys, it's Brennan J, and today we are at one of my favorite places in the world. We are at a beautiful hidden spring down here in Florida. You might look behind here and see all this freaking green stuff and slime and think it's a swamp, but prepare to be amazed because under all of that slime is one of the most beautiful springs I have ever seen in my life. Seriously, look at this, look at this, look at that. Oh my goodness, it is literally paradise right here. So today's video is actually sponsored by Fish Brain. They're a really cool fishing app that I'm gonna break down a little bit later in today's video. However, me being the guy that I am, I can't just go out and do a traditional fishing video. I wanna spice things up. I wanna switch it up. So today I'm gonna be diving deep down in this spring and under all of that nasty slime and see if I can catch some fish underwater. Before I actually do any underwater fishing, I do wanna go and explore, but I gotta see if the fish are even biting first. So I'm just gonna do a quick little toss in. Quick little, oh, that was terrible. All right, we'll see. Can I catch anything out in the center? No. Oh gosh, they're coming. They're... Dude, I got one. I got one, dude, first cast. <laughs> first cast, are you kidding me? Look at this little guy, he's beautiful, man. Little did he know. <laughs> wow, this thing is gorgeous, man. All right, buddy. Oh, it's your lucky day. All right, well, now that we know the fish are biting, the fish are down there, we're gonna take a quick look under the water to see how many fish are down there, if there's any big ones, and then we are gonna get to underwater fishing. Oh my gosh, now you guys see why I'm so in love with this spot. It is so beautiful and we did see some fish down there. However, we also found a few more guys who are gonna be diving this here today. They're not doing underwater fishing. I'm trying to talk them into it. You guys actually watch the videos, right? Yeah. Yeah, so crazy man popped out of water they were like jig in i was like no way what's up man so so now we've reached part of the video that most of you guys have been waiting for we are going to hop into the water do a little bit of underwater fishing see what different type of species we can catch today but before we do that i do want to break down the fish brain app for you guys they sponsored today's video and they're honestly a pretty cool app so i'm going to tell you about some of the key features and how this could potentially help you guys catch fish as well so if you guys have never heard of fish brain before imagine like an instagram but just for fishing you can actually up Upload all of your photos of your catches. You guys are most likely going to be uploading these giant 10 pound largemouth bass. Meanwhile, I'm going to be uploading little baby fish that I caught in the spring today. But not only that, you can also meet a bunch of different anglers around you. So if you're always searching for a fishing buddy and you never want to go fishing alone, just hop on Fish Brain, find a fisherman that's near you. Hopefully, you can find somebody that's catching big fish, see what they're posting, and go fishing with them. Fish Brain also solves two of the biggest problems I have when it comes to fishing. One of those problems is I am always on the road, I'm always traveling to new places. So it's kind of hard to know where I can go fish or like where the honey holes are It has an interactive map that lets you know where fishing holes are that are near you guys But my all-time favorite thing about the app is it actually has species recognition So if you've ever caught a fish and you've just looked at that thing like I have no idea What the heck kind of fish this is you can actually take a picture of it upload it and the app will actually tell you with Artificial intelligence what type of fish that is it's honestly one of the coolest things any fishing app has ever done and don't you worry We are definitely 
definitely going to be putting that to the test today. They also allow you to keep track of all of the fish that you've caught over an extended period of time. So, I mean, years and years of fish, you can go back and see when you caught that 10 pounder three years ago, what the weather was like, all of that information you can save on this app. You can also share all of your best fishing spots with your friends, but if you're someone like me who can barely find one, you can keep it to yourself. You don't have to share it with anybody else if you don't want to. So the best thing about all of this is all of those things that I just told you are completely free. All you got to do is click the link in the description below, download Fishbrain, and you're going to have access to all of that. However, I do got to tell you, they have some pretty sick premium features. One of those actually has a data-driven fishing forecast, which basically tells you the best time, the best place, the best date, the best bait for every fish species you could possibly imagine. Also, it has contours of the lakes. So you can see the depths and shallows of all of the different lakes in your area. But if that was not enough and you still go out there and you're not able to catch a fish, don't worry. Fish Brain's got your back. They're going to give you millions of exact fish catch locations. So if you're going out there like good old Brandon J, and you're just not catching anything you can pull up your map see where people have actually caught fish drive right to that spot cast out and you know the fish are going to be biting there so if you guys are into fishing make sure you download the link in the description below remember it is totally free it doesn't cost you a thing if you're a fisherman why not try it it could put you on that 10 pound largemouth bass or it could put you on a 12 pounder <laughs> All you got to do is download Fishbrain, the link below, and then uh, just type in Jigging with Jordan on your search engine. You guys will find me on Fishbrain. Shoot me a message. Let's talk. Let's see who has caught a bigger fish. Most likely it's you guys. There's a little fish lined up at my feet right now. I promise you. Dude, he's looking at my lure. I'm not kidding. Look, 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 look. Dude, he ate it. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm not even making that up. Dude, that is so funny. Today is going to be a good day of fishing, boys. That is so funny. We haven't even dove yet. All right, fishing underwater. Wish me luck, guys. Wow, so I actually caught one and then there was a giant one. I was like enticing. I was like, come on, come on, please, please, please. And then he bit it. I was like, oh my gosh, I had him. But then he came off. It's so hard to like set the hook underwater because you don't have any like hook set power. And uh, so the biggest one actually came off. But I've been using like this big bait right here. I'm actually going to switch right now. Uh, I brought some earthworm. So I'm going to take little pieces of earthworm, set it on the end of this hook. And that way, like any size fish is going to be able to do it. I think it's going to help me a lot. Uh, but we're going to go back in, try to catch a few more. I think the next fish I catch, I'm going to actually pull it out of the water, take a picture of it on fish brain um, and see what kind of fish it actually is. Which It's going to be kind of interesting to see. So we're going to hop in, put a little piece of worm on and see what type of fish we can catch. <laughs> Dude, there's so many <laughs> way back in these bushes, man. They're making me work for it. Oh, it's crazy, man. I have to like sneak up on them. It's so insane. Oh, 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 oh,
All right, so right now we're actually on fish frame. We're gonna take a picture of this little dude. So I got the little picture of uh, the fish. We're gonna say use photo. And now it's gonna detect the species. And it says 52% rock bass, 42% uh, bluegill. So the app is saying it's uh, either one of those species, but it is like a hybrid uh, little fish. So super cool that actually tells you what type of fish it is. I was a little skeptical, I'm not gonna lie, but uh, actually did a great job, so. I can post this now. I can actually let you know where I caught this fish, but you guys will have to check out my account to uh, know where this secret honey hole is. But that's actually super cool that it lets you know what type of fish this is. We're gonna get this uh, little guy back in the water so he can meet up with all his friends in that beautiful spring over there. And uh, we're gonna keep fishing. I got, I actually ended up getting a little guy. <laughs> There's a whole family of them down there, man. See a little butt? <laughs> I ended up catching so many little fish down there. It was a blast, man. I always have so much fun doing this. And uh, last time I was free diving, it's so much easier with a scuba tank. I can just sit there and like <laughs> convince them to bite. All right, guys, but well, that is going to be pretty much it for today's video. I don't know about you guys, but I had a freaking blast. It is so much fun, not only swimming in the springs and just exploring, but catching these fish underwater is so addicting. I had my little bait. I was like, come on, little fishy. Come on, bite, bite, bite. <laughs> and it was just so funny watching them go after it and then like trying to set the hook in the water. It was just a good time. If you guys have never done this, you got to try it. You gotta try it at least once. It's so much fun. Also, giant shout out to Fish Brain for actually sponsoring today's video. I did the underwater fishing today because of them. So remember, if you wanna check out the app, it's gonna be linked in the description below. There's absolutely no reason why you shouldn't at least go check it out. It's totally free, does not cost you a thing. I myself am on there, Jigama Jordan. Make sure you search and find me. I'm gonna be posting some of my favorite underwater pictures that we took of the fish today. If you wanna check that out and see where the secret location is, make sure you find me on Fish Brain. Follow me on there. I'm gonna have all that information on the account. You guys probably can't see it but there is one fish just swimming right there he's taunting me i will jump back in for you fish and with that being said that is gonna wrap up today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it just as much as i enjoyed coming out here this is honestly one of the coolest most unique places i have ever visited in my life i've been a lot of different places in the world and this is like a top three for sure if you want to see more spring videos where i go and try to find more secret locations like this let me know in the comment section below and that's gonna be pretty much it thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed today's video and as always i will catch you guys on the next adventure peace out right there i'm gonna get him <laughs> i just had so much water get in my nose dude i'm pretty sure i just flushed out my whole brain <laughs> what is that like 12 13 14 foot dude water just went through my whole i feel like i just washed out my brain